goodness is a, a good cup of, of coffee. No, uh, what we're talking about today is goodness and, and the fruit of the Spirit, that aspect of the fruit of the Spirit that, that dwells within us because of the power of the Holy Spirit. Now, over the last few days, I've been able to, to hear some stories of goodness, um, of, of people actually just living out what it means to, to live a good life. Because goodness does the right thing and it challenges others to do the same. Um, goodness is decent and honest and, and moral. Goodness is honorable, virtuous, and it's full of integrity. And over the past few weeks, I've heard of a few stories. One that took place in a grocery store similar to, to this, where um, a, a couple people from our, our church here at Luther Memorial, they were doing their shopping and this young lady, um, she found $300 just sitting on the ground. And she called her dad and her dad came over and, and they knew what they had to do. They, they picked it up and they went to the um, customer service desk and just said, I don't know, has anybody come and said they've lost some money um, and they were gonna give it back and she was gonna go talk to her manager and see what they could do to figure out how to get this to this person. And just at that time, a gentleman came back in and went to the customer service desk. And this father and daughter overheard it and they brought it to the man and he was just thrilled that the, the goodness of these people's hearts came out and returned that $300 in full to him. He even offered a reward, but they didn't take it because they just knew out of the goodness of their heart, because of the spirit that dwelled within them, that they had to return to this man what was his. And a couple other ones. $40,000, I heard, was found in like a, a, a chair that was bought at a thrift shop. And the people that bought it found that money and then they didn't keep it. They went back to that thrift shop and they found the rightful owner through the work of those people and they returned the money to them. And then another one, uh, someone I, I know, um, uh, one of their good friends passed away and, and some people went in to clean out the, uh, the apartment where he was living and, and he had um, uh, a sizable amount of cash um, tucked away um, in there. And, and these people that were cleaning it out found it and they didn't keep it. <laughs> they knew the, the goodness that was in their heart. They knew that they needed to return it to my friend so that it could get to the hands of the rightful person. See, goodness happens all around us, all the time. But in our world today, we don't hear a lot about it, do we? We hear about the bad things that are going on. But friends, goodness is always happening. And that's something that we all can continue to learn and grow in as we do good, as that aspect of the fruit of the Spirit dwells within us and then comes out from us. So that's my encouragement to you. Keep your eyes open. See how God is at work around you and do good. And that doesn't mean, again, you just do the right thing, but you do something good to make things right. I pray that you are blessed and the goodness that dwells within you can come out as you love God's people around you. Be blessed.